Welcome to Add a Little Dazzle. In today's video, we're going to learn how to mount Stamping Up Clear Stamp Sets. Some of the great features of using the Clear Stamp Sets is that they require much less space than the original woodblock stamp sets. In addition, with our new clear blocks, you will be able to put multiple stamp images on here and stamp them all at one time. Because this is a clear block and the image will be shown here, as you can see, you will be able to see exactly what is on the other side and position it correctly to where you want to stamp it. So let's get started. Okay, as you can see here, all stamp, clear stamp sets come in DVD cases. And the great thing is because they come in these cases, they can be housed in any any storage system created to hold DVDs. The artwork that you see on the front here is an actually shown at 100%, so the actual size you see here is the actual size of your stamp set. In addition, if you look at the spine, you will see that the title of the stamp set is right here along with thumbnail images of the stamp set. So when you're storing storing this you can see at all times what is on it. In addition these cases are clear so you will be able to see on the back exactly which stamp set you are using. So to begin with let's go ahead and open the case and you're gonna see that the case comes with instructions right here on the left hand side. Um, these are not the instructions that I'm going to be using. I'm going to be doing it a little bit differently. And so let me show you. Here are your rubber stamps. I've already assembled some of them. And here is my image sheet. And so what I'm going to do is I'm going to pull out the rubber stamps. And I'm going to begin by showing you how to mount this one. So we're going to do this one, which is actually the cake right here. And by the way, this Love and Laughter stamp set is found in the Occasions Mini and it will be retiring at the end of the month on April 30th. So if you want to get the stamp set, you need to go ahead and get it now before it's gone. Okay, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to leave it right there where it is and I'm going to come in and I'm going to peel the white film that's over the stamped image. Okay, just tore a little bit there, but that doesn't do anything or damage anything. All I need to do is just, there we go, peel it off. Use your nails or a sharp little object and it'll come right off without any problem. Okay, so there it is. And so now what you are going to do is you're going to take, here's the image of the cake. And so I'm going to peel the entire thing off. And this is the side that's actually going to be showing on top. And so what I'm going to do is I'm only going to peel, um, if you flip it over, you're going to see that there's this slit right here. And I'm only going to peel half of it off. And the reason I'm going to do that is because I want to make sure that I get my aligning just right. And so once I've made sure that my it's aligned correctly, then I'm going to just turn it over and peel the other side and then attach it. And then I can just punch it out. and it's ready to use. And like I said before, the great thing is that you can, let me show you, when you're using the clear blocks, then you could see exactly what you're doing without any problems. And if you wanted to add more than one stamp set, then you would be able to do that. And let me show you. And so that's just another great feature of using the clear stamp sets that you would not have with the actual wooden block stamp sets. 
So as you can see here, I've placed a bunch of them all together and it's that easy to assemble your clear stamp sets. We hope this video has answered your questions about mountain stamping up clear stamp sets. We invite you to visit us at www.addalittledazzle.com where you can find many more tutorials and project ideas. We also invite you to visit our Stamping Up and Add a Little Dazzle store where you can find products for all your crafting needs. If you have any questions, please email me at monica at addalittledazzle.com. Thanks and have a dazzling day.